Can I take that for you? These pictures are awesome. Wait, wait. Thanks. Hi everyone, this is my dear friend Matt Pai. He's studying to be a doctor at the University of Minnesota. And this is Savita Ben. She's a member of Sewa from Vashrashpur village in Gujarat, India. Did I say that right? Yes, Matt Pai. Very good. <laughs> I can't believe what's happened since you finished the well. It blows my mind. We couldn't have done it without you. It's so hard to believe how much things have changed in six months. I still remember waking up before dawn and walking four miles for water. How long did that take? Two to three hours, if there was enough water. When I brag to my friends about you, which I do a lot, they always ask why you didn't just take out a microloan. My friend did, and she started a successful vegetable stand. But I spent all my time collecting water. Even if I had a loan, I never had time to use it. But you can't make money from a well. True, but now that I have water, I also have time. And I started my own grocery store. That's awesome. I never thought I could have that kind of impact. But Mad Pie, you are a medical student. How did you raise $5,000? I have a wonderful network of friends and family. All I had to do was tell them your story, and I knew they'd want to help. It has been fun sending you messages and updates on the project. So awesome, right? Everyone is always blown away when they see the impact the well is having on your community. Oh, so cute. How did you raise all the money? I sat down with some friends and we came up with a bunch of ideas. Silent auction, community bake sale, even a music benefit. But I remember photos of people running. Yeah, we decided on hosting a small 5K run. The messages from your friends were very sweet. Yeah, it was a great event. I mean, people still talk about it, how they reconnected with old friends and, and feel like they actually made a difference. And they did. And many of your friends are doing their own projects. <laughs> it's true. I, we thought we were just helping you, but you really helped bring together our community. Well, the impact you had was great. 550 people now have access to clean water. Community health is improving, and children are spending more time in school. Wow, that's awesome. It's amazing how many positive things have come about from overcoming this one hurdle. And access to clean water is only one of them. Yeah, Carolyn, you did an education project, right? Hi, Matt. Yes, I partnered with Doomer Village to fund a child care center, and Paul and Preston did a citizen effect clean water project. Yeah, we partnered with Barcadia Village to help them repair their well. But my favorite is the biogas project. Hey, girls. Thanks, guys. We partnered with Sonolnagar Village to build biogas plants that create clean heating and cooking gas. And it creates organic fertilizer for their farm. And you can join us in making a difference. Just visit citizeneffect.org to become a citizen philanthropist and partner with the community in need. You ready to go? Yes, but I'm buying. All right, but I've got the tip.